up girls and boys what is up internet i am bianca and welcome to our classics vault let's play for one of my most favorite games of all time suikoden 2. i know i know it's pretty much an old game released on the first playstation back in 1998 but it still stands as one of the best JRPGs I've ever played. And since we have already made content on the first Suikoden game before, I thought that it was high time that we continue playing the rest of this franchise. Now, before we actually dive in, there are just a few things I would like to say in regards with this playthrough. First off, we will be getting all the endings in this game, of which this title has four. I will also be picking up all 108 recruitable characters and completing all available side quests in the game. Second, this will have commentary in it, but only when there is a need for it. Like, if I have some tips or tricks to share about a particular section in the game, or if we have any trivia tidbits. Third, there is grinding in this game, especially if we want to make battles a little bit easier or to obtain certain items. I will be doing this off cam since it would take such a long time if we were to record and to include all of the grinding in these videos. Fourth, I will be using my save from the first Suikoden game and importing it here in the second one, mainly to get boosted stat characters and making Tyr, the protagonist from the first game, available to us. And lastly, you might see achievements popping out in the bottom of the game screen, and that's because I've connected into retro achievements, where achievements have had been integrated into these old games. It's fun playing with those on because it gives us an added motivation to replay these old games. Now, my main goal in making this video, apart from the purpose of, again, continuing on with the Suikoden franchise playthrough, which I will be trying to do all of, is that I want the newer generations of gamers to know about this game and this franchise. And for those of us who do know about it, to feel nostalgic about it because sadly this is one of those franchises that Konami doesn't really care much about nowadays and that there is very little options in regards with getting to play this game but anyways that's enough for this intro let's get right into the epicness that is Suikoden 2 
Hold it! All right, so here's the deal. We are given two options here. We can either go east or go north. And I'm picking north just to be able to save time in this section, as even if you opt to go east, you will still end up taking the path north anyways. one of the places where you can level up early and it's something I would highly suggest you do if you're planning to play this game. You will end up being given a choice and by selecting the first option thrice and the second option after that, you will end up being in a loop of battles. Now, there is a secret to this early battle. If you fight 108 times, you will end up getting a colored scene in the next cutscene rather than the usual default black and white one which i am going to show side by side later since i did go through all that trouble of fighting 111 battles or fighting this battle 111 times which took me 78 minutes to do and got me to a decent level for both rio and joey and to prove that, I actually did a tally on the number of battles that I did just to be able to, um, you know, make note of how many those battles are. I'm not sure if you guys can see it right here. That's the tally that I made. And I even included, um, it's right over here, included how many minutes it took because I had to rest for a while because this was pretty mind-numbing to do. Anyways, moving on.
different things.